coming to the end of these 100 days of breakthrough heading uh, for day one of uh, 2021 and uh, just these last three days of this year to go so number 97 message number 97 of this uh, 100 days of breakthrough and uh, it's been quite a year and uh, you know we might have had dreams before this year and we're we're waiting for those dreams to uh, to be fulfilled, waiting for that breakthrough. And uh, there's a verse that I just want to close out this year with, and that's 1 uh, Samuel 30, verse 8. It says, David inquired of the Lord, shall I pursue? And uh, the Lord says to David, you shall surely pursue, overtake, and you shall rescue or recover all. And um, I, I want to just uh, end out this year for everyone on here with with a challenge based based around the kind of the sense of that verse. David really was distressed. The people were talking of stoning him. Uh, he strengthened himself in the Lord, a verse which many of us know well from Bill Johnson's teaching and his book, Strengthen Yourself in the Lord. How do you do that? You remind yourself of the testimonies of what God has done. And you uh, pick up your prophecies and uh, remind yourself what God has said he will do. And uh, and then he goes on and, and David says, shall I pursue? And God says, yeah, you do it. Go for it. Now, I want to use that as a as a basis for something. And this is what I want to do. Um, you know, for many years and, and many of us have done this. There's a thing in the, the corporate world, the strategic planning world uh, called a SWOT analysis strengths weakness opportunities and threats and i've um i've started to develop in in some of the things that i'm uh, i'm developing and in the process of launching a uh, my version of that and and the first the first one of those we're just going to run through those four for these last uh, four days and uh and you know leave leaving leading into day one on friday one one twenty one and uh the first one is build. You see, I'm, I'm good with having a look at strengths, but here's what I want you to do. I want to challenge you. I want to challenge you to identify your strength at the beginning of 2021. What's your strength and build on it? I have been uh, thinking and observing and, you know, some of the, the entrepreneurs, uh, the leaders, the bosses, they're, they're very single focused. Actually, um, sometimes a little easier to be single focused when you're the boss, when you're a, when you're a number two or when you're on a team. You're kind of jack of all trades, making things work. But, but I really do believe that many of us need to develop our one thing. I've been thinking about that uh, for me for a long time. I've had a mission statement, uh, which is changed lives, changed organizations and changed nations. And, and I'm good with that, but I, I've, I've got a feeling I'm about to change it. And uh, I want to change it, something like this. I, I, I want to do everything I can to help you be the best you you can be, or for your organization to be the best organization it can be. And uh, I want to really narrow my focus and follow like the Lord said to me about strategy recently. And, uh, and that's what I'm beginning to uh, just to pursue and to focus on. But I want to challenge you, what's your strength? Uh, build on it. That B is the first letter of my SWOT analysis. Instead of identifying a strength, I want to identify an action. Build. Build on your strength. What's your strength? Your breakthrough is the other side of building on your strengths. And I want to just encourage you with that. Shall I pursue? Shall I build on my strength? Yeah, do it. For you shall not only uh, pursue, but you will overtake and you will recover or rescue all and uh, someone encourage you build on your strength identify your strength and build on it what is it and uh, just just take a moment today the next 24 hours and tomorrow we're going to look at another one of these uh, we've kind of playing around with the SWOT analysis instead of strengths weaknesses opportunities threats we're going to have build and I'll tell you what the second one is tomorrow night but build, build on your strengths. What's your strengths for 2021? Will you build on your strengths and believe that your breakthrough is the other side of identifying your strength and building on it? And I, for one, know that 
Uh, there's many aspects of being a jack of all trades, and I never say master of none, but there's many aspects of that that are really good. But sometimes it spreads us a little too thin, and I have a feeling that it's time for us to identify our strength and build on it. Day 97 of these 100 days of breakthrough, we're heading for 98 tomorrow. But uh, I just want to bless you with that. David, such a low point in his life. And the Lord said, pursue, pursue for you shall surely overtake and recover all. I believe it's a word of the Lord for many of us as we close out this year and we head into next year. Let's build on our strengths. Be for build. Well, thanks for joining me. I'll see you again soon. Good night. Bless you.